four tanks in the front and the three big stainless tanks in the back. And that's what we're bottling out of seven different wines. So we're getting everything set up and uh, pretty soon we will be putting wine into bottles. John Patterson's here from Patterson Cellars. I've known John for much too long uh, <laughs> when I think about that. Um, and John brought his bottling equipment out and he's the one that's gonna be uh, bottling. Um, so what we have here, he's just sanitizing the inside here. So the wine will go into, into this container here. We'll pump it in there. The bottles fit on these spouts and get filled up. Once they're filled up, we pull them off and put them in this contraption here. There's a little spring-loaded mechanism here. When that happens, the corks come out of here and get plunged into the bottle. Um, we're doing corks this afternoon. We're doing screw caps this morning uh, for the first three wines and the screw capper has not been set up yet. Um, over here is a pump. That's how we're gonna pump uh, the wine from the tanks into the, the filler. Um, over there by the forklift, uh, the thing on the left there, that is the um, screw capper. So that's what we use for doing the screw caps. Okay, so we start with uh, the bottles being emptied from the cases. And she is putting nitrogen in the bottles, so sparging, it's called sparging with nitrogen. And that chases oxygen out. So we have a pretty oxygen free environment for the wine. The wine then goes through a filter, which is in a silver housing. It's a, a long tube that's actually a filter. And that filters out impurities in the wine. Um, then we put it on the filler. So, um, the top of the filler is where the wine goes into up there, and then it, the bottles fill up automatically. They stop at the correct location that can be adjusted. Uh, then we take the bottles off of the filler. Now this would be the corker, so if we were putting corks on these bottles, they would go, you can see how it goes up and down, it's all connected. The cork would get pressed into there. Um, that's a screw cap. So that's what a screw cap looks like before it's put on the bottle. So it just gets put on there, and then the screw capper comes down and tightens that. Um, so when you have a screw cap wine, that's how it's that's how we create the screw cap there. Then it's simply taken off. Um, then the we wipe down the bottles. I just call it quality control. Just kind of make sure the bottle's not too wet from any wine and condensation. Um, sometimes, especially in the winter, the wine is colder in here than the wine, we get condensation, but today it, the temperature outside is about what it is inside, so it's, it's pretty good. After the bottles are wiped, they get labeled, 